Coming. Whoa. Going. My word. Let's see if we can get a sound check. Coming to you live from the original home of the coffee mug, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Your pal Johnny Six Gun coming to you live from Switchblade Studios with part two of Cuphead. We've got the delicious last chorus title screen going here. We've got the DLC delicious last chorus. You get it? Do you see? The DLC. So we're, we're getting back into it, folks. No time to waste. The devil has our souls by the sacks. Cuphead and his pale Mugman, Ernie Mugman, have got to get the contracts of all these debtors that oh the devil. Otherwise, they're in deep. But let us not fret, folks. We're going to get right back into it. I've gone back to the first stage, and I've beaten all these boss characters on uh, the normal mode. So we're going to warm up with some of them. We're going to check out the alternate phases we didn't get to see last time. I'm going to show you some new... Weapons and powers I've acquired for Cuphead Mega Man. <laughs> Mega Man. Good luck, Mega Man. Good luck, Mug Man. And Cuphead. Let's check out some of these first stage bosses again. Let's warm up. Let's go ahead and get the roundabout. I'll take the roundabout. And how about the spread? Let's. Spread on the new super art. Let's try out the giant ghost. We've acquired a new super art, so let's give that a whirl. Charm, I have acquired the twin heart. I have two extra hit points now. That's five cuphead hits instead of the standard three. The firepower is weakened, but as long as we are alive, there is hope. That's my belief. That's what we're going with. So let's uh, check out the Botanic Panic on regular as we're warming up here in part two of Cuphead, playing on the PlayStation 4 this evening. This was originally released on the X-Bone, the Xbox One, if you will. 
Really enjoying this roundabout weapon. All right, we've already taken down this hater tater. Oh, and here's a onion that just makes me want to cry. Still haven't quite figured out how to use that soul body superpower. I'm sure it's devastating in the... Oh, I'm a dunce. But that's alright, we took out that onion. We didn't see that in the simple mode last week. We've seen this goofy hypno carrot, however. He reminds me that, yes, we do indeed want to use that dash button. There we go, he's got the Doctor Strange third eye. The old bendy up there, maybe. Alright, we've saved up enough juice for this super attack again. Let's see what shakes out. Oh, okay, I kind of control it. I, I got it. That's a knockout. There we go. We took one hit, and we took down the first round of crooks in Cuphead. So, if you power up your character, get those coins. Holy crow, we did pretty well there. That's an A+. Plus. Golly, a perfect score. That's a nice way to start it out, gang. That's, that's uh, things looking up here heard tell you can only get an S rank in the expert mode. Oh, we got the, the gold flagpole, though. That's kind of nice. Let's head on down to the old clip joint calamity. A couple of pugilistic croakers here. Little uh, froggy bottoms. Did not switch our weapons. That's okay. I would very much have liked to have turned that super back onto the regular super attack. That's more my speed. More Iron Man circa Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Speaking of games old Johnny played on the Dreamcast. Heard tell that the one of my favorite RPGs on the Dreamcast, Skies of Arcadia, may be getting a re-release. So that's cool for the folks that still don't have that Dreamcast disc like old Johnny. Maybe you've got that special edition on the... Oh, there's our third form. We didn't see this last time, gang. Let's see if we can take down this sloppy slot machine. Oh, not doing great, actually. Taking a lot of damage on that phase. Not keeping the cool, but that's that's okay. We're just warming up here. We've already beaten all these stage one bosses on normal. Ah, oh, hamburgers. That's okay. We did uh, well enough. Just kind of showcasing these alternate phases that you might have missed out on. Did do a little offline grinding, so to speak, here in Cuphead. I think it was to everyone's benefit. Aside from a few coins and some stages, I'd like to maybe get a new weapon or two at some point. But, ooh, a, a ruse of an ooze. Regular. Once again, revisiting the Dragon Quest slime here. Let's get more centered. Hope everyone's centered this evening, doing well, surviving the early spring. Oh, that was awful. Yeah, I like this roundabout weapon that I've purchased. You can just keep running away. That enemy takes all the damage. Like the eyebrows, like that bean nose. And 
once again forgot to equip that standard issue super attack which I do enjoy so much oh that's gotta be doing a number on them though that's gotta be rocking them there we go we haven't seen this phase before we've got to take out the roaming tombstone of this slippery slime RIP you slippery slime ball so we're just shredding through these bosses on normal now no prob that's a B that's a brand new record B is for brand new everything was brand new in the 1930s and 20s back when uh, Maybe Max Fleischer was making some nice Superman cartoons. I've heard tell those are getting a Blu-ray release if you're a big fan of old-timey Superman. Let's take to the skies with the threatening Zeppelin here on regular mode. Played it only on simple last week and now I've uh, become quite the Cuphead expert. That's not at all the case. I'm playing a little bit offline though, and it's it's been fun. I'm getting hooked on Cuphead. I'm hooked on Cuphead brand because Cuphead's. I I was just waiting for it. What was I thinking? Ram a lama ding dong. This song routinely pops into my head now. It's not a not a good thing. It's not really a bad thing, it's just a thing. Oh my dear. Still warming up. Getting the range finder on. Oh dear. Hoping to get to that. Oh, we'll try that one again, just for kicks. One thing, though, before we give that one more shot, just while it's still in my head, I'm gonna turn that super art back to the energy beam. This, I don't know, it doesn't matter. Affects this stage not at all. Onwards and upwards. Did get to check out some cool... Oh, I'm an idiot. I just rolled right into that. Got to see some cool Pink Panther cartoons this weekend. A little, uh, my favorite rat thinking to Roland. Real, uh, foppish dandy. Roland always haphazardly saving the day from that dastardly rat fink. If ever Cad was to tie a woman to the railroad tracks, it might be rat fink. Let's check those out. Pretty cool. Been watching a lot of Gumby recently, stop motion animation. We kind of brought up a little of that last time. We're talking about animation as we're playing Cuphead here. Let me guess about 2018 that's come out, 2019. Doing pretty bad. Talking and squawking. Ooh. But that's all right. We're just checking out all the phases of these first level bosses that we didn't get to see last time. Whoops-a-daisy. Since cleared these stages and we're not gonna worry about it. Here we go. We didn't see this last time Just got the uh, that that bug guy thing. There we go. That's pretty cool. Destroy the core What a chore Oh hamburgers we died but That's okay. Just showing it off a little bit. We're gonna exit to the map. We've got no time to worry about 
These first level bosses, gang, I've cleared them. We're not going to worry about it. Floral Fury, one more time, regular mode. Love this flower's little cha-cha dance there. Heard tell that Sega's bringing back Samba de Amigo, the class act Maracas game. First introduced once again. Here we go talking about the Sega Dreamcast tonight. Whoops. It's too busy focused on where I was going and not where I was. Really uh, concerned about this puke up top here. Got those whirly gig helicopter. Jesus, Louise. Gotta get focus in here. There we go. Now we're getting back into it. Oh my. Is he having a. Bear of a time, apparently. Oh, oh. That's why we like to save up that super weapon a little bit. We did not see this form last time, so here it is. Check it out this time. And this time only. It's a one and done, possibly. Hey, it's a knockout. She's a knockout. Drinking this. Open Gate Brewery Guinness Baltimore Blonde Beer was somewhat on sale. B minus. Hey, that's above average, and that's an uh, above average outcome for old Cuphead here. As we venture away from Island 1 to Inkwell Isle 2. We're going to be spending a bit of time here later. Here we go. We've uh, cleared this Sugarland Shimmy on regular. Let's give that one shot. It introduces another mini boss and another... I think there's a last form that we didn't see before. So let's check it out. Pretty neat. Oh, it's that waffle again. Still not a big fan. Although I'm very much a fan of what uh, you can do with the waffle iron. I made a lot of savory waffles myself in the past year or and so. Corn dogs in the waffle iron. Moon waffles. Who do we got? Oh, it's the splattering cupcake. He's uh, half-baked, you could say. His world views are shattered. He is a shell of a human being. He's a, quite literally living garbage. I hate you, you jumping cupcake bastard. You, you, you battered bastard. <laughs> Got a little greedy there, but that's okay. Here we go. We got this uh, Numb Nuts. He's a bit of a puke. Whoops. All right. We're on the move now. That cake's a uh, walking. Don't come a knocking. All right. Probably not going to succeed. We'll sure as shit do our damnedest. We died. The cake had its sweet way with us, but that's okay. We're not going to retry. Already beat it, beaten them. We're going to exit to map. I shouldn't throw a gender on that cake. Shouldn't call the cake a him. It's just an awful cake. So yeah, we've seen all these bosses on zany old carnival stage something i do want to show off briefly if i may it's pretty rare when i find a genuine secret in a video game we'll replace some of these bosses which i've 
cleared. I did clear the third mausoleum stage. That's a challenge stage where you have to protect and earn from these ghosts that are coming in. It's good practice for your parrying, where you can jump on pink bullets in this. You absorb the strength and use it for your own super attacks. Very useful. But I was reminded of a recent playthrough of Super Mario World on SNES. I wanted to get a perfect run and over like three gameplay sessions got a star 96 playthrough, no sweat. But a good trick for that is uh, going back into those ghost houses. Well, ghost houses is no problem, but when you beat a fortress or a castle in Mario World, you can't go back in unless you hold down L and R and uh, press the button. So, you know, just for kicks, it's like, oh, I can't go in the mausoleum again. Hold down L and R. Press the X button, and I can play it again. So they, they threw that in there. That was a nod to Mario World. I tried it because I played Mario World recently. It worked. So now I get to show you Mausoleum 3 again. Can't really do better than beating it. So, you know, we'll, we'll give it a shot. Fun uh, to hear the spooky music. Cagney, Lacey, and Kong. Oh, we've died already, so that was a bit of treachery there. We can certainly do better, but I have already beaten this. That's where I got that. Oh, already died again. Didn't do great once again. That's where I got that third superpower by beating this. This will be our last attempt. We haven't the time, people. Very much reminiscent of that old Disney cartoon where Mickey, Goofy, and Donald are hunting. Hunting ghosts, that's a classic. There we go, doing marginally better this time. But yeah, I dig this. This is my Donkey Kong country roots showing here if I can get through Bramble Scramble I can beat these ghosts ooh that old man ghost old grandpa ghost maybe they're gonna reboot ghost dad you can have uh Ghost Mom. That would be kind of nice. The Ghost Mom can have a movie now. Well, there we go. So that's that's a fun Easter egg. You'd get nothing from it. Let's be honest, fellas. Shall we? Ooh. Ooh, we're kind of getting put down by this urchin here. Looks like a uh, fork. Dork fork. Don't want a fork in the dork. All right, now there are some bosses I still haven't played yet, so the Marine Corps, let's check it out on Simple. Why not? I still haven't seen this boss. Let's see what we got. Still some fun. All right, here we go. We got a dirty rat in a soup can tank. A bit can tankerous, if you ask me. Oh, nuts. Chock full of nuts. Alright, I see what's going on here. I kind of like this. Oh dear, is that a bad old putty tad out there? Can't get enough of some of the swing music here. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, he is capping my ass with these bottles of beer. All right, so yeah, just about took down that dirty rat on simple. Let's give another whirl here. Hey there, Cholso. How we doing, sir? Good evening. All right, let's see what's happening here. There's a spread of fire on the ground. 
Now look out, folks. It is spring vermin. Population is on the rise. Oh, Cuphead, you kind of shit the bed there, pal. Really want to see what that kitty's up to out there. Could potentially be a bad cat. That wouldn't be a good thing. Ah, nuts. I think we were even closer that time. Not terribly. That's okay. We'll get back to the rat brigade. Rat Patrol. A little Metal Gear Solid 4 for you, I guess. Kind of surprised that that's never seen release anywhere but that PlayStation 3. Hey, one night only, let's head out to that theater. Rats off to you. That's a classic, the dramatic fanatic. Get ready for a... Uh, you might see a few references in this one, folks. No need to uh, tell you Final Fantasy VI references abound here. Maybe not abound, but there might be a couple. Seems that Hubby in the background's having a spot of bother. This Bridezilla has really lost the plot here. Now well, there we go, Nadis uh, Auga there. Asbestos, made with real asbestos to prevent fires. Oh, nuts. Like those little wind-up mice, fun. Children and pet alike. All right, there we go. Here comes the Final Fantasy stuff. Very Kefka, last boss looking. Get ready for a summon. The big wave. Oh, dumbass, forgot to dash there. Here comes the meteor. Look at those. Oh, dumb dumb. Hey, knockout on simple. But yeah, look at uh, Meteor in the corner. Meteor and comes down. So yeah, you know, you always got to have those little Final Fantasy nods, I guess. <laughs> oh, Ultros the Octopus. Love that Ultros the Octopus at the Opera House. Final Fantasy VI, a class act villain. Seafood soup. Muscle heads. Hate them. But if that weren't enough, if you're not convinced of the Final Fantasy VI, after that theater, after that night at the opera, you head up to this train. The Railroad Wraith. Could this be a nod to Final Fantasy VI's Doom Train? Let's... I'll let you be the judge. Or maybe a nice... Guillermo del Toro reference, all the uh, handy eyeball hands, the handy eyes, or candy eyes. Certainly not as mournful of music as the Doom Train and Final Fantasy VI, very Bizarre and somehow emotional scene there. Shouldn't say somehow. Those Final Fantasy games could elicit some emotions back in the 16-bit era. Great music. Certainly helped Nobuo Uematsu. Some uh, 
Not really sure what's going on with these guys, but oh, oh, there we go. There's a the shocker, the shock master. Ow. That just didn't really go very well. That's that's okay. Oh, I see. I can uh did not know I could move the rail cart with the pink handles there. Should have noticed that. Oh, and that happened. That's something I didn't really want to happen, and that's that's okay. So we're playing this on simple right now. We're just having a nice little showcase. Hey, it's a knockout. Bingo. Good call, folks. Got to check out LL Illustrations streams. Check out his Mario 64 playthrough. I've been fiending to play Mario 64 again recently. Opted instead to play some Mario Galaxy. Never got all 120 doodads in that one. But Mario 64, you better believe you've got some hand eyes going on in that one. Well, let's see, we haven't checked out all these bosses yet. We don't want to go into the Devil's Casino quite yet. You want to take this fun shortcut through the junkyard, though. Haven't been to this wacky shack yet. The junkyard jive. Junk jive. First, you have to junk yard jive and whale. But yeah, no, Mars uh, replaying Mario Galaxy. Oh, right, we got the Iron Giant here. Oh, we've got uh, another shoot him up, another shmup stage here. Oh, I don't like that. There's a lot I uh, don't like about what's going on here. Oh, all right. All right, this is uh, not going great, but that's okay. It's a first effort. You're never going to beat a Cuphead boss on your first go, presumably. I'm certainly not. Just a big fan of these shooting games. Not a ace by any stretch of imagination, but folks, I have this bizarre inkling that with time and patience, perhaps, Oopsie daisy we might be able to beat this one. We might be able to take the cup head down. So there we go. We haven't seen that guy yet. Let's head back to the map. We still do have another run and gun stage. We never saw all of that one either. So yeah, we've got some we got some stuff to check out. But before we progress any further, I do have to report some minorly upsetting news that in order to get into oh we haven't checked this out yet. In order to get into the Devil's Casino, we're gonna have to beat every single one of these bosses on normal. So I haven't even beaten them all on simple yet. Only got one of them on the second level beaten on normal, and then we've got all these guys on the, the third level. Yeah, Galaxy makes me car sick. I heard that. Honestly, I gave up. Let's go high seas hijinks. I gave up on it. I, I wasn't having fun. I was playing a level with a song that just kind of irked me. I just realized, you know, I'm not having fun with Mario Galaxy, so I quit. That, that's okay. I was just thinking maybe I'll pick up Mario Galaxy 2 again. Well, this turtle looks pretty treacherous. Go for that seahorse.
Yeah, this is just a very cool boss. Electric Shrimp, one of the more deadly modern super animals. Oh, those electric eels. Almost as deadly as the flying squirrel. Holy crow. Have to depetrify there. Shake the sillies off. That's a knockout. Knocked out that knockout. She can go noodling for my cop any day of the week, says Hobo. Egad, sir. I I heard that. Actually, that's a nice uh, point, classic Mr. Show line. Before I die, I'm gonna fuck me a fish. That's right, baby loves her coffee mug. Tonight's title in the vein of the Monsters of Megaphone. Coffee mug, baby loves her coffee mug. Going crazy about that coffee mug. No more drinking out of her hands. Thank you. Fantastic sketch. Must be seen to be believed. Alright, you stinking rat. We're not going to horse around anymore, folks. We're going to start playing some of these on normal. And we're just going to start getting good. We're going to have... Have as much fun as we can with Cuphead. We're going to talk about cartoons here and there. Some di disjointed uh, rhetoric on... I don't know, pretty much nonsense. There we go, take this to a can. Cantankerous can. Alright, those... Uh, So the bottle buzz saw is really cool moving around in the normal mode. I'm liking it. Yeah, the I think the challenge in Cuphead is just oh it just it it hooks ya. Oh, that's all my fault. See I'm not not learning quickly enough, but I will eventually. Wasn't checking the signals there. But we'll see. We'll know by the end of uh, this evening whether or not we're even going to attempt a Part 3 on Cuphead. Cuphead brought to you tonight in honor of one of our favorite viewers, Captain Lucky, a.k.a. J-Dub. Wanted to see Johnny challenge the Cuphead, see what would happen. As we can see, we're having a great time checking out this zany... Jazzy swing music. But Cab Calloway is turning into a, maybe a no way. But we'll see what happens. Look out for the fire. Alright, but you should uh, still avoid those bombs. Oh, there we go. Finally dodged him for once, and that's okay. It's a dodgy proposal. Yeah, we're probably going to take a break. <laughs> this will be the finale when it comes to shooters. Six Guns Shooting Gallery has been a resounding success in my opinion. We haven't beaten 100 games yet, but we've gotten a little closer and we've had some fun doing it. Oh my, this is... Uh Really quite the stage here. We'll make sure not to get the Mega Man Itis where you keep replaying a level so many times that you forget what you're doing and you start unlearning what you're doing. There we go, only got hit one time there. That's okay. It's 
pretty much throwing Charlie Brown's Thanksgiving feast at us there. Popcorn, jelly beans, oh shit. Failed to parry on that thing. That's unfortunate. Admiral Perry really got us there. Thank you, Sega Madness. Greatly appreciate the wishes of good luck. I'm certainly going to need them. We're going to take a step back to stage two, I believe. We're going to try to clear some of these earlier bosses on normal. Because if we don't, we don't even get to see the last few bosses. That was my intention, to at least see all the bosses in Cuphead, but... Ooh, they're locked up behind those barriers, those skill barriers, which is an okay thing. That's that's what creates a video game, I suppose. We've got that B there, but we'll uh, let, let her be. As we've got bees wax to contend with here on Stage two here in the Funhouse Frazzle. Let's do it real quick. We maybe poked at this one once or twice last week, and uh, th there's some fun stuff in here. We'll do a quick run. I think I got all the coins out of here. Kind of botch that one. That's okay. Sorry, we got the wall from Contra here. Honk, honk. No sweat for Mr. Cuphead here. I like these guys, very reminiscent of something you'd find on one of Bowser's airships in Super Mario Brothers 3, maybe firing cannonballs or bullet bills. Like these unicycle rockets. There we go. We should have the tuba here. This is essentially why I want to show this one. That's a fellow that did the music for Inception right there. There we go. That Essentially, I just wanted to show this stage just to show off these goofy tubas. Tubas in Zubas. That could be a nice ripoff of bananas in pajamas. Tubas wearing Zubas. Going to Zumba class and hacking the Roombas. <laughs> Once again, the player piano music is really going all out. Depending on your love of jazz and ragtime, your mileage with the... Uh-oh, I don't like uh-oh. We've got uh-oh. Hey, bravo, bellissima. So, you can learn Cuphead. Top grade B. Did we do a little B etter this time? Didn't do great on the pairing, but that's okay. That's a that's another B. I can think of a word that starts with B. Ah, the wall from Secret of Mana. Always uh, was very partial to the Rabbites myself. One of my favorite low-level enemies in video games. Oh, just, I'm not even gonna look, folks. You can see how many times I've died. I'm not even looking. I always get upset when I find out. Let's check out the carnival kerfuffle here. No more clowning around.
There we go. I'm doing okay. Oh, nuts. I was doing okay there. Still doing okay. We're doing all right. He's not doing all right. Not doing as well as the uh, crusty boss from, oh, hamburgers. I'm not great at this horse bit when the train is involved. Ouch. Not doing great. This one, ooh, ouch. I should have been switching some weapons there. Haven't bested this rascal's last phase yet, but I think I think we can do it, folks. We all have to embrace the retry button. Don't don't abuse it. Don't let it take over your life. But very calmly. Use that retry button instead of starting out on a shaky start. I mean, that shaky start, that could be the one. That might have been your victory. But statistically, nah, probably not. It sucks. Alright, that was alright. probably see the last phase this time. I don't think I'll beat it, but we'll give it a shot. Nuts. Well, that's okay. We're doing okay, folks. I think, uh, you know, we got. The, I love how it just turns into that wild carousel, Ferris wheel thingamabob, the old swingamajig. And I think we're showing some real pluck, some real resolve, some stick to itiveness, dedication, and a little uh, sheer stupidity. So let's keep throwing our heads against the walls here. As we persist in round two here, live on the infernet. Your pale giant six undoing cuphead. Springtime in the Midwest. Wouldn't know it from the snow out there, but Twin Cities hasn't been dissed with the white stuff days now so that's that's nice no it's starting to warm up the seasonal affective disorder is not as big a deal now that went well as could have hoped for speaking of uh, things going as well as they could have hoped for there was a crossover promotion with Arby's and Cuphead, if you can believe it, not only Shovel Knight, but also Cuphead had the honor of working with the most distinguished, distinguished of purveyors of roast beef and other 
hot meats. We're just gonna try to survive. That's not the way to do it. That that was certainly not ideal. I think I want to try a different weapon combo, and then we're gonna move on to another boss. Check out some other third and final forms. I think rather than that chaser, we're gonna go with that spread. There's still a couple more coins out there for us, too, if we wanted to try to purchase another weapon, perhaps. If anybody out in TV land has any suggestions, let me know in the chats. Leave a message in the comments if you'd like. I'd probably give your comment a thumbs up and uh, that little user love thing. User love, that sounds like something uh, a bit racy from the R-rated version of Tron. Alright, here we go, digging this. Oh, I was to a point. There's the point. Oh, that dirty nag. Ain't what she used to be. Oh, gets me every time. Good one. Ooh, too close. Oh, not that train again. All right, I've been able to reserve special attack for this garbage dump of a monstrosity. Let's unload and see what shakes out two hit points. Wait till these little scums are on the loose. Hey, that's a knockout, folks. We can knock these guys out on normal. Just takes a little of the old one, two, buckle my shoe, three, four. Drink some more. A B minus, that's all right, because we're taking them down one by one tonight. Live on the internet. Don't know why I never really used that much. That was, hey, there we go, Beppy the Clown. Dude, there we go. There we go, we've got a nice little mug emblazoned on our flag there. Oh, we've got that shooter stage. Pyramid Peril. Pinchers of Peril. Let's hit it. Maybe uh, we'll find a lamp and Will Smith's genie can get us out of this jam. This is a real genie jam. I guess. We're racing to a hundred, folks. Hundred games beaten online. Can we do it? Oh, shit. Alright, now we're going to use the friendly retry button. No, never use the retry button in anger. Don't make that association. That's going to hurt you as a game player. Of those snipping swords there, they are 
hungry for blood. Whoa, old Pink was a bit late to the party there. There we go, first phase cleared. Let's be careful. Let's be small. So we've got to contest with these, ah, crazy blades in the normal version. Oh, shit, the blade was hidden behind those well-placed palm trees. A couple of hits there, but we've got two extra hits with that handy-dandy power-up. Let's just hope we can... Bam, we got him. Popped him one there. Kind of dig these shooter stages. Pretty fun. Ah, shit. Shitter stages. Let's try out those bombs again. We haven't used the bombs very much recently. Oh, that was all right. There we go. We've got the crazy puppet mode again. That's all right. It's better to dodge these attacks than to... than to succumb. Shit. That's all right. I think we're doing okay for a few first attempts. Got the flying cat scarabs, that's all right. That's about as Egyptian as it gets. Let's do better this time. That's how we do it in uh, Cuphead's America. That's cool. Hey gang, we did it. God damn, these bosses are cool. <laughs> Not too shabby, Cuphead. Dancing machine. There we go. I think that's. Let's get those flowing red locks going here. Doesn't look great. That's fine. As we clear out these scumbags one by one, taking them down, 
can't even see the last boss unless we get all these pukes taken down on normal folks. Can we do it? I'm so crazy. I'm... Hey, we're missing a coin there. We're sitting at zero coins right now. We got another flying shooter stage. Can we do it? Hot on the heels of that lucky win. Let's try it out. More wild tuba music. Can you believe it? Dumbass. Oh, nuts. That one came out of left field, but we're doing better. Getting better at this one. I wonder. I don't think so. We'll give that one the uh, loving retry. This clock is driving me cuckoo. And the bucks, it's costing me our buku. A yoo-hoo. Hey, who's ever had that yoo-hoo drink before? It's not chocolate milk, it's just a chocolate drink. It's okay. As far as uh, corn syrup based chocolate beverages are concerned, yoo-hoo's okay. Ah, oh, shit my pants on that one. That's okay. I'd rather botch a super than take a hit. I think that's a fair trade. Oh, just falling apart. Oh, that was dangerous. That was bad. Bad call, blue. Gotta go with the flow on this guy. Still haven't seen the final form yet on this battle. Should be coming up as long as I don't botch it. We botched it. That's fine. Just about got to the final form, but I think we're formulating some good strategies here. 
forming some great memories, building trusted bonds, stocks and bonds, James Bond Jr. Da 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 da. Oh, dumb dumb, just sat there. Waiting for that face full of egg. Well, I guess there is egg on my face now. Oh, nuts. Ooh, I don't like it, I don't like it. Scary. Falling apart, falling apart very quickly. Nuts. That's okay, I think... I think we just about... I wouldn't say we've got it licked. All right, now we're just getting kind of sloppy. Old slop head, oh dear. All right, that was a travesty. Prefurbed birds should have gotten them bronzed. One more shot on this bird, and then we're gonna mosey on to another stage two boss, or maybe stage three. So we gotta take them all down, folks. Every single one of these cartoon masterpieces. He has to be taken down cell by cell. Or Cuphead and his friend are going to hell. This Kong's one hell of a guy. Ooh, too close. Oh, fool. Fool of a took. That's all that it took. Hey, who's gonna check out those new Lord of the Rings movies, gang? Huh? Ugh. Sure, it'll be fine. Who would you like to see in them? Who's going to be that Gandalf? Matt Berry? All right.
right, new form. Let's check it out. A bit of luck. Oh, medical treatment. Damn. That was fun. Even without my feathers, you're in for a stormy weather. Almost want to give that one one more shot. I think we have to. See, that's Cuphead. That's, that's where they get you hooked. Intentionally defeating these pink guys. I, oh, awful. Yeah, I'm not gonna take that hit. We'll let them go. We're not gonna parry the pink ones. We're not gonna worry about it. We're not gonna fill the super meter. It'll all happen. Cup happens. Am I right? Oh, dumbass. Yeah, no, no sunglasses, no goofy characters or anything, no eating spicy things. We just, I'm just gonna try to beat the Cuphead. I'm gonna try not to listen to too much big band jazz. I don't know where the Chattanooga Choo Choo is. I don't want to know. Cuphead, you fool. Oh, nuts. There's a capsule from Akira. Did me in. But I think we've just about got it. I think with a little more help from our friends, we've got it. Not in a two-player sense. Sometimes these games are a little trickier with two players, even if you can revive each other. All right, I don't think we took a hit, so that's fine. I'll take it. That time, I'm that I'm not as thrilled about. That's okay. It's a video game. Who who gives a toss? Am I right, gang? Oh, toss it up. 
now it's all just sort of falling apart. Got the running schnazola, that's rarely a helping thing. Alright, yeah, I like that. Oh, okay, they split. All right, good to know. That's a knockout, gang. And that's Cuphead. It's not the hardest game. I mean... We even saw evidence of this in a recent fail where we played an indie game called Radio Squid. Used a mechanic that just didn't really click for me. I didn't care for it that much. It's super cheap. It's an easy platinum. You can watch my video or play it yourself. Radio Squid, make up your own mind. But the last boss, Wally Wobbles. It's another one down, stage two. But yeah, we I, I wound up giving up on Radio Squid. Something I I was so close a few times, but did I beat all these guys? There's got to be another stage two boss, right? That's a run and gun. We're not too worried about that. Oh, here we go. This awful dragon. Wally well, wobbles, but he did fall down. Good evening, J-Dub, our benefactor for the evening, the only member by my reckoning who was able to attend every physical meeting of the Twin Cities Game Club, J-Dub. So, uh, good evening, sir. Curious, I have recently found the Samyang 1X spicy chicken ramen, as opposed to the 2X, which you were saddled with. Curious on your opinions of the 2X spicy ramen. Very delicious, but almost inedible by my standards. Oh, they're delicious. And, uh, folks, I have not been doing that much extra practicing outside of the stream. This is, a, I think this is an attainable game for most folks. I think a lot of people would be surprised how good they could do with Cuphead.
All right, it's only the uh, second time I've ever gotten to this form, actually. Oh, that, <laughs> I did worse on it than I had pre previously. I think I uh, want a different... Boy, I think I do want a different weapon. We're gonna exit to the map. We gotta take down all these enemies on normal. Where we can't get to the last level. Let's keep doing it, gang. Oh, yep, I uh, heard you on that one. Cap. Too damn hot. Yeah, the 1X is more manageable. I'll let you know how that is. I used to eat that one more often, but... I forgot how bad that 2X spicy was. Let's go with the old classic pea shooter. Wearing our double heart relic allows us to take two more hits than we regularly would, but it makes our firepower a little weaker. Once we take down this dragon, we can get down to stage three biz. Where's that tail? Speaking of where's that tail, recently checking out your favorite Wiseacre Mel Mackian, Alf Gordon Shumway himself. The 96 Project Alf must have been a made for TV movie or something. It's awful. It's got Martin Sheen in it. If that does anything for you. Supposedly still stars Miguel Ferrer, or Ferrer perhaps, of Robocop and Twin Peaks fame. Didn't make it far enough to see him. There we go, doing better. Got into the uh, vicious Hydra here. Been foiled by the Hydra, the Hydra foil. Failed again, that's okay. Let's just go for it. Ooh, I gotta check out that post on that old elf cartoon. I don't know why. Everything's coming up Alf recently. Pretty certain the comedian that voiced Alf is, uh, oh shit. We're gonna do the friendly retry there. Never retry in anger, people. Don't retry in anger, come on. It's just not proper. It's kind of slopper. Oh, nuts. Kinda curious to just keep using this pea shooter. Seems to be a pretty effective weapon. And again, these ring ringy bobs are pretty fun. Pretty wackadoo. Oh, good one, guys. Oh, Cuphead, what are you doing? Okay, doing poorly again, that's fine. Ooh, right in the old toaster there, that blowtorch got us. That was pretty cool, at least. 
I think, you know, I think that I've got to exit to map. We're going to go with the sure shot. Let's do it. Let's be smart. Let's keep switching up our weapons combos for all these different bosses we encounter in Cuphead. Unless you're some sort of savant. Oh, I did want to see what that thing was... Elf was about, and I need a free fill on the drinkster. It'll all come together after we defeat this dragon. Oh, Cuphead, you really, really shit the clout on that one. Not a great start. That's okay. This is where I want the homing. So we get those sure hits as we're dodging. I think we can dodge these little bastards a little more easily from this vantage. So let's let's do that. Let's use the homing weapon and uh, oh, and then fail regardless. That's the way we do it. Oh man, yeah, I'd like to, maybe I'll have to check out some of those old elf cartoons. Okay, there's, oh yeah, the hybrid. All right, we got this under control, folks. We're going to get a quick free fill. In a few minutes, we'll be back with Cuphead. Let's go ahead and get that fun title screen going. All right, back in a flash.
Coming back to you live from the home of Frankenberry, your pal Johnny Six Gun playing Cuphead Part 2. To my horror, I discovered that you have to beat every boss on normal, otherwise you don't even get to see the last two bosses. It was my goal to see all the bosses, but it was also my goal to see all these fun, crazy General Mills monster characters they sent me. The last round of Count Chocula, Frankenberry, Booberry, and Fruit Brute, you can enter to win four figurines of the Monster Serial Monsters, and by gum, I won, and they just arrived in the mail yesterday. My life is all the better for it. Thank you, General Mills. Thank you, Monster Serials. And thanks, everybody, for tuning in tonight. Having some fun with Cuphead. Now that we've bought enough relics where we could get the double heart at the shop. Been doing a lot better. Still using the first super art. Even though we got all three available. And we're doing it. We're chipping away. And the Mega Man 2 dragon here. You could use some Alka-Seltzer, perhaps. All right, we uh, deserved that one. Just reading a treatise today on humor not to have in your manuscripts, be they book, television program, movie. All the humor you don't want. This is what you don't want. You don't want referential humor. You don't want word plays. You don't want dad jokes. Essentially anything that uh, would be part of my shtick. That was bad. That was really bad. That fell apart very quickly. I don't know if I'm married to this weapon combination quite yet. We'll keep testing it out. I like that wobbly tail sound. That's fun. Wobble wobble. Not doing great, Cuphead. Not doing great. I'll just stay off of the screen. It didn't work. Oh my goodness. I think I'm gonna have to start paying attention to those guys. I know they're remoting in their attacks somehow, but I'm not paying attention to them. There we go, just swilling the strawberry guava hard seltzer all over the place like a drunken pig. That's how Johnny rolls. Here with my Luke Skywalker here. Want Sebastian Stan to be Luke Skywalker. Nuts to that. Johnny Six Guns Gotta Eat Baby. Disney Plus, come come on over. Do, uh, do some business with old Johnny Six Gun. I'll do whatever you want for money. 
That's that's how we roll here. Play video games and we sell out immediately. Cuphead, you blew it. I do, I don't know if I feel bad or not, but I have not been keeping up on the Star Wars. I didn't do the Obi-Wan Kenobi. I haven't seen the Boba Fett thing, didn't do the... Whatever that other thing was, that Rogue One prequel thing, I didn't, I didn't see that. Even though I think I heard Andy Serkis is in that, I like him. Oh, oh, Cuphead, you're uh, kind of botching it there, buddy. Yeah, I'm just not learning at all. Let's move on. Let's quit Mega Manning there. Let's not keep n knocking our head against the wall. Let's take on some new bosses, get a fresh pers perspective. Let's head back to Inkwell Isle 3. We haven't even seen some of these bosses' normal forms yet. All right, let's check out the Honeycomb Herald. Cleared on simple, but not on regular. That's something that's got to happen. All right, the Andor. That's that's the good one. All right. Yeah, I did the first couple seasons of that Mandalorian. See, I mean, it's fine. This is totally not. What I'd like to be equipped with going into this match. Let's switch it up. I'll take the roundabout. Let's try that spread. Start spreading the nose. Says Tony Randall as the brain in Gremlins 2. I'll always bring up Gremlins 2 every chance that I can. Well, that was already a disaster. We got this B copper here. Beware. Got those drones, those worker bees, toiling away with their briefcases, just uh, falling apart here quickly. That happens sometimes. Oh shit. Sometimes you just lose it. We got by the first form, finally. Not great. Now the queen is not pleased. Because of the bees. Oh, watch out for that bee magic. Bee wary. Where are you, Cuphead? You really fucked the bee on that one. Did poorly at best. And 
Doing okay, though. I think that's okay. Not as okay. Not as okay. So I think what's probably going to happen, folks... I'm going to keep playing Cuphead offline. That's almost guaranteed to happen. And then if we get to a point where I unlock the last bosses, then maybe we'll do a part three. I think that's probably how this is going to happen. I do not. I don't see great success happening tonight. It's just not enough literal time to master all these bosses, but I've done better than I thought I would at Cuphead. If you're on the fence, I, I, I almost want to recommend it to just about anybody, but it's so, so prohibitive. I don't know. Hit the high seas with shooting and looting. Cap'n Briny Beard. You and the Cap'n. Make it happen. Alright, I don't remember this guy too well. Only played him a little bit at the end of the first stream. Oh, yeah, he calls in all these uh, fun critters. He's dogfish. That's pretty good. I like that. All right, there we go. Got the uh, trunk in the junk there. got away with that a lot longer than I thought I would. That might have just been a My Hero reference, an old Sega reference, those flying dog collars. I, I can't imagine it was, oh no, did I totally just boff, boff, did I totally boff that? Oh, the shark's here, I missed the shark remote in because I was so excited by a potential Sega reference. That's okay to be excited by a Sega reference, just don't let it affect your gameplay this terribly. Should not have gone for that parry. That was bad. I think this one's doable. We're not... Not at 100% quite yet, but we're getting there. Squid again. Squid video. There's that shark. Oh, 
Alright, that was a bit of a mess. Nuts almost got to his last form, I think. Oh, not quite. But yeah, Skies of Arcadia re-release. That's pretty cool. That, that's not a uh, that's not enough for me to buy it again, I guess. I probably at this point want to dust off the Dreamcast plate again, but if you've never played Skies of Arcadia, you got to try it, folks. Sky Pirates and Treasure Hunting. Sky Battles are so cool. High encounter rate on the Dreamcast. Don't know if they fixed that on the GameCube version. If they did, great. Missing one coin on that one. We could try that again. Perilous Piers, let's try it out just to have a poke at it, check out what's happening on the piers. Oh, I remember what this one was. I don't care for this stage. Especially with this weapon set. Yuck. I do like those fuzz balls a lot. Crabby Crabs, pretty cool. Oh, yeah, these backpedaling shrimp, not too keen on these guys. Best to just press on. Please press on nails. There's only one coin I'm missing in this stage. It would be cool to find it. Oh, Cuphead, why did you do to do that? Oh, there it is. Alright, well, I could potentially get that coin pretty easily if I'd like to. Huh, but I'm not too worried about it. Oh, they always blow the exit, the, the quit game. I don't like that at the end of the stage. Too easy to accidentally go back to the Final Fantasy VII looking title screen here. Poor Mugman not getting too much love tonight. Who here has checked out that Netflix Cuphead series? I've heard tell some of the viewers' children watch the program, and they enjoy that. Oh, no, haven't gotten this one on regular yet. So, yeah, it's uh, suitable for children, I guess. Uh, is this game suitable for children? I don't... I mean, they're going to love the graphics for sure. Every, I, I don't know, I mean, kids aren't going to do great at this game, but... No, they're not, they're not going to like this at all. Just show them the Netflix thing, they'll hopefully be okay with that. Yeah, that seahorse just sort of spits you up towards the top of the screen. Take a hike, yeah, Dizzy Dame. Uh, Fugu, very dangerous. Ow! Told you, very dangerous. Yeah, take a hike. Oh, not the yellow fish. There we go, got some Castlevania vibes there, a little Medusa for you. 
didn't do too great. Wasn't very impressed with the performance there. This is reminiscent of one of my favorite Kenny vs. Spenny episodes. Who can keep an octopus on their head the longest? If it sounds ridiculous, it's because it is ridiculous. Especially once the acid is involved. So be sure to check that out if you enjoy Canadian humor, eh? Kenny vs. Spenny, who can wear a dead octopus on their head the longest? One of my uh, favorite 22-minute blocks of comedy of all time. I suppose. If I had to take a... Uh, Make a top 100, would that episode, top 100 funniest things, would that be on there? I don't know. Oh, did I get hit? That was foolish. Alright, she's stoned to the bone. Oh, we've got a... Oh, look out for those green things. Now very Castlevania looking. Castlevania meets Scramble. Maybe Castlevania meets Gradius. Holy mackerel. Is that your best effort? Let's try it again, gang. No goofy gimmicks tonight. We're not allowed to cheat on Cuphead. No horse in the round. That's kind of a horse hit there. Horse shit. No horse shit, Jack. Not off to a great start on this round, but that's okay. Keep going, keep practicing. Oh, kind of getting double teamed here. That's. You know, it's a bad pull. Sometimes you just have bad luck on a run. Sometimes you have good luck. That was a bad skill in addition to bad luck. a shaky start. That's okay. Got greedy there. Just really trying to push her over the edge, and that didn't take. Oh dear. Time for a snack roll with that yellow mackerel. Can't spell meal without eel. Time to make some unagi. Unagi them out. Unagi yo jimbo. Ok. 
Okay. Hey, that's a knockout, gang. That's not too shab. All that practice on Scramble and Gradius 2 really did the trick. And that's what makes Cuphead nice when you're playing something tough like a Dark Souls. It's that last... and I was getting at this earlier when I was talking about Radio Squid. It's that trek back to the boss that'll kill you. It's not doing the boss battle over and over and over. It's that 15 minute trudge to get back to that fight. That 10 minute level, that 20 minute level to get back to that boss try again. That's, that's what'll kill you. So, Cuphead just being a total boss rush where it's nothing but boss battles, a couple of, uh, throw away run and gun stages nothing crazy but yeah that's that's not bad let's try this one with the regular mode enabled and yes Stage curtains were made of asbestos to prevent fire. That happened in theaters. Hot lights, hot bulbs, candles burning. Alright, doing pretty bad. We're going to do a friendly retry. There we go, they have to get back to St. Charles Place, or uh, Baltic Avenue, perhaps. I'm not a big fan of this phase, so I'm just going to try to end it as quickly as possible. Oh yeah, it's more of a pain in the ass on normal, so here we go. Got the Final Fantasy ending phase here. Lightning attack, alright, that's a new, I don't know that one. Meteor, I know. It's a Final Fantasy staple. The big wave, the tsunami, oh no! prematurely use that handy dandy meteor there we go got a little too close for comfort oh almost made it to the final phase digging this battle though feels very much like a fight maybe from silhouette mirage nice treasure 2d shoot em up which I enjoy. All right, got a little lucky there, that's fine. Those goofy wind-up cars are still lurking.
Battle on the big wave. I can dodge lightning all day, gang. All right, there we go. What's up next? There we go, that's the grand finale there. Very cool battle. There we go, that's another one on normal, folks. These third stage levels, we're taking them down on normal. Can your pale Johnny Six Gun actually beat a game as difficult as Cuphead without cheating? And if I could, would you be surprised? Send check and money order my way and you'll find out. Sally stage play. You're going to the going to the devil's fuck pile. All right, still got some uh, we got that junk robot to check out. Got that. Now you know, folks. We better check out this casino entrance, Inkwell Hell. Let's see what's going on in here. Let's take a little peek, shall we? Might not be worthy quite yet, but we, uh, that's not going to stop us. A little bit like Bowser's Castle, that secondary door over there, maybe. Ooh, there it is. The Valley of the Devil. See if we got anything. Hey, we got a gold coin. There we go. That's a freebie. If we can find a couple more coins. We'll be sitting pretty. We could fire up another weapon that might break the case on some of these other Lao's bosses we're hanging around. All bets are off. Let's see what happens. Hold it right there, you. What? You might have busted up some of them deadbeats, but you don't have all their soul contracts. You ain't seen the big cheese till you got all those contracts, you glubby, grubby little bits. All of them. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. So... That's what happens, folks. You get all the way up to the casino, clear all those stages on simple, and you're stopped in your tracks. But, as you can see, if you just keep chipping away, you can take these creeps down a peg. The Railroad Wraith. Here we go, the Doom Train. I believe Gorillas had a song called Doom Train. I don't remember if that was on an EP or what. Oh, there's a flying jack o lantern. That's just. That's just swell. I like how he drops those. Pink bricks moving the car around. That's kind of neat. Phase three, haven't seen this bit yet. Oh wait, no, I didn't. 
I do recall this bit. I don't care for it. Alright, so at least I know what to do for that section now. So I, I think... I think we gotta just keep plugging away at the Doom Train, gang. Yeah, I've heard Gorillaz do have another album coming out, and that they had a animated film in the works with Cuphead's friends at Netflix, but that that's not going to materialize. So you'll, uh, you're just stuck watching all those good old Gorillaz videos, I'm afraid. How unfortunate for you. You know, we're going to take this one in stride. A little sloppy, but I'm uh, grasping that portion of the battle more correctly now. And by gum, we're gonna see this final phase of the boss pretty quick, I think. So I don't know, is Cuphead the hardest game ever made? I've already played harder games on this channel, I guarantee you that. And in many cases, I cheated to uh, beat those games. So if I can beat this without cheating, that's, that says that, uh, you know, Cuphead's it's not too bad. Oh, dear. Here we go, haven't seen this phase yet. All right, there's the Doom Train we know and love. Throw a Phoenix down at it, hit it with the suplex. Oh my God. Damn, I really wanted to parry that thing's tail. Ooh, man. Oh, they just draw you in. This first phase usually goes by without any major incident. I like that. Second phase shouldn't be a biggie. Oh, totally botched it, thought. That's okay, not too worried about it. 
take it this man's the conductor. Or perhaps a giant gorilla skeleton from Castlevania 64, aka Castlevania. can't even hit me from over here. Why am I so concerned? Let's stay safe, stay away. Forgot about that other weapon I had. That's that's okay. We'll let that go. Oh, come on. That ghost brick got me. Hey, that's a knockout, folks. That's another one. Doom train down. More like the down train. Downtrodden. Outridden. Arthritic. Mathematic. Appomatics. Tonight's special quote from Bob Barker. I think I've been mugged. Uttered after a... Wild contestant was so excited and just gave him a good shaking. Hey, the Phantom Express, that's headed right to the devil's orifice or his office. Look at this. We're taking bosses down left, right, and center. I don't know that we're going to have any other option but to attempt Cuphead a third and final time. I still might take some of these bosses down offline. There we go, here comes the kooky professor and the iron giant, or maybe it's a big guy and rusty. You choose your giant robot friend, Johnny Sacco and his giant robot. God, I think he requires tungsten, everybody. And we got the uh, magnetron. That's bad news. Oh, jeez. I don't like any of that. Set him finally. That took a bit longer than, uh. Okay, digging those twisty arms. That's okay, I think. Wow. Yeah, we never took this fella down on simple, so why, why even bother at this point? Right in the bread basket. Oh. Yeah, I don't like those little ships. Let's try to snuff out that little production zone there. Got a little uh, master mold type vibes coming off of this dude. There we go. This is more like it. Damn. Whew. Did poorly. Let's Mega Man that one again. We got Doc Wiley up there. Dr. Wiley. Good, good news, uh, Mega Man. Yes, we'll keep doing Mega Man 8 voices. We'll keep talking about 
whatever it is that we talked about here. That's that's how it is going to go for a few more games. Oh, this is going very badly at this point. That's okay. I think we've had a few good shows tonight. I gotta see if there's something on the map that, you know, maybe like a tally sheet that said how many bosses we've taken down. I'd like to just see that. I, I doubt that there is. It doesn't look like there is. That's okay. Because we haven't taken down the garbage man. We've got a run and gun stage we haven't even completed yet. Let's give it a shot. These are usually very infuri infuriating and they have awful music. I could be wrong. Here oh, it's this one. I, I really don't care for this one. I've uh, failed routinely at this stage, but who knows? Maybe I've grown as a player since. Or as a person. Oh, no, I haven't. Anything I've grown stupider. So we're going to let that one be. Next time we happen by the shop, maybe we'll see what's available. We're more concerned with clearing these boss battles. Let's do it. that Stonehenge looking stuff down there. I want to find more free coins on the map, damn it. Oh, we never did uh, finish Captain Bluto. Got that one coin we could probably get at some point. Alright, we took down the mermaid, commits a mermaider. We did the theater. The Doom Train, I know we've got the Dragon, the Mega Man 2 Dragon, we've got the Mega Man 2 Giant Robot. It's always Mega Man, Mega Man, just haunting me. Maybe that means I have to play a Mega Man game, Oh. Alright, let's see what's happening with this mouse in the house. All right, botch that. Yeah, that's okay. Still not uh, fully grasping this battle, that's okay. This is one that I only saw for the first time tonight. Wanted to keep some surprises in the store for me and you. That's that, that's what I like to do. I don't like whenever I'm leveling up offline or beating bosses offline. It just seems sly, sneaky, disingenuous. I mean, if I'm going to cheat, I'd rather just cheat to your face. Ow. Oh, that was a pretty big misstep. Really botching it here all around. That's okay. Okay, I think, uh, I think I'm digging this guy. If 
finally, finally did it for once. Still haven't ironed out the timing on that, that's okay. And then, uh, scratched my nose and died instantly. I sometimes wonder how many driving accidents are caused on a yearly basis due to sneezing, coughing, other involuntary herky-jerky movements. Not of the driver's own volition. That sneaky cat. Oh dear. Alright, now we gotta battle this hungry kitty. Okay. Mice ghosts, I like that a lot. Ow. Oh, nuts. I think we're doing okay on the cat. Oh, that was fun. Me ouch. That's all right. We'll just take the hit. Doing great, that's okay. All right, and down you go, Mousy. Mouse in the spaghetti house. Slammy winks, slammy winks, slammy winks. We got this one, folks. All right, let's let's not get too fancy. Let's go with what we know. I just always seem to botch it. Count Botula. I don't like where that one's headed. It's quite frankly put me off. That's okay. Wasn't paying attention there. We're starting to drift a little. That's that's okay. Oof. All 
Alright. Oh no, I got hit by the piece of wood there. That's okay. I think we got it. for a loop. Good one, mouse. Hey, we finally got a clean dodge. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you know? Hey, that's a knockout. That's a cat down. Oh! Turns out the German mouse was controlling the cat the whole time. That's fantastic. Mouse in the house! Rouse! Mouse! That's a brand new record. If only defeating real mice were so simple. Werner Vermen, very good Werner Vermen, you are taking your soul to the devil, be devil. Let's try out this bees, again the honeycomb herald. Oh, I don't like that triangle. Multiple triangles, that's not cool. pink bouncing thing more than I like the, uh, whoops, dumbass, the triangles. I think we've got a chance here. If we can do a little bit better on the first phase, we got it. Not as uh, bad as dealing with real bees in the house. No one likes bees in the house. We're outside. No one, no one likes bees in general, I suppose. They make honey. It's kind of weird that we just steal it from them. Hey, guys, are you going to eat all this honey you made? Nope. I'm going to eat it. Because you're a bunch of stupid bees. What are you going to do about it? I got your honey already. There's nothing you can do, bees. 
fly back to your home planet. Oh, dumbass. That's, that's okay. It's okay to be the dumbass on occasion. Which is to say, most occasions. That went terribly very quickly. Right on. What have we got left here, folks? Honestly, we do not have that many more bosses to clear on regular mode until we unlock the last few stages of Cuphead. We got the bees. We got the bots. Bots, the babysitter bandits. Well, let's see, maybe that evil Dice King will let us in. Maybe we've done well enough to enter Inkwell Hell. Maybe we didn't need as many contracts as I thought. Maybe we'll have a hero's welcome. All bets are off. Good luck. Hold it right there, you scums. So, not quite yet. So, if we circle around from this direction, I do believe we've got... Captain Briny Beard just pissing me off over here. Let's do some shooting and looting. Not looting and polluting. I think we were pretty close on this one. Let's give it a shot. Barrel's really getting worked over. Barrel of fun. We got a shark incoming here. Let's avoid that. Oh, look out for those. Dogfish. So our prospects get dicier, all this crazy crap going on here. Didn't look out for the cannonball, but I, I'm kind of digging this fight. Maybe we're going to go with the survival method here. Where I'm just going to avoid everything and just let the homing thing do its job. Do its slob, why not? Not even gonna bother switching weapons between phases. Just gonna relax. Hope everyone else is relaxing out there. Sometimes the troubles of the world are too much and it's time for Cuphead to make you wish you were back in the real world. Ow. You goofy croctopus.
Oi, Tiger. Over that uvula there. Well, that doesn't look good. I don't like those. All right. Uh, okay. That's my fault. Damn. Oh, we're getting close. I think. Oh, this. I oh man. I just want. I want to beat this game, folks. Not the best for commentary. Apologize for folks looking for some sort of a keen observation, but this is a uh, taking a little, a bit, little bit more of my skill. Can't sacrifice hand eye coordination for shitty dialogue, sadly. Oh. I figure this way I can charge up that super. Should be ready. About the time we gotta contend with that awful uvula at the end. Oh, it's all falling apart right now. Let's not count chickens before they've hatched. Alright, it's go time. Haven't quite made it yet. Oh, shit, I just can't figure those guys out. That's okay. All right, now I'm getting sloppy, getting a case of the Mega Man-itis. Let's be careful for that. Keep reserved, keep calm. Sit directly in front of the television in a well-lit room for optimal play.
I have the dogfish again. Shit. The dog shit. I kind of got cornered there. Can't win them all. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. As you can see, I'm not quitting. This is this is fun. This is a fun challenge. This is a rarity in video games. I typically don't like a difficult game. I don't like a game just because it's difficult. The game happens to be difficult and it's good. Well, you know, array, I guess. Oh, Cuphead, you goon. Sort of good for trying to parry, that's okay. Maybe I'll learn a lesson one of these days. Probably not. Oh, here comes the laser. Forgot about the laser. Charge and my lasers. That's a knockout, gang. We did it again. Another one on normal. Down for the count. Didn't even get the opportunity to use that super, but we're doing it. Unbelievably, we are getting through Cuphead. From grade D to grade A. Grade A asshole, Johnny Six Gun, knocking them down for you. If you were too afraid, if you didn't think you had what it took, well, Captain Briny Beard is now in the captain's boneyard, courtesy of Johnny 06 Gun. Only a couple more here. We've got the bees. We got that uh, crazy robot up there, and we got that damn dragon. Dragging us down. Let's try him out again. I'm instilled with newfound confidence that we can take the fiery frolic down, thereby clearing all of the bosses on Inkwell Isle 2, finally. I mean, come on. And I'm starting to realize that, and I hate to say it, I hate to play the blame game, but I've had Cuphead on steam on my PC for a few years now. Never gotten more than four hours of play into it. That's what steam even told me. And I think the reason was the controller. I always use my Xbox 360 controllers. Remember that thing, guys? Got the wireless dongle. Whoops, just kind of jumped into that. Well, well done, Cuphead. All right, kind of got greedy, tried to. All right, it's all going pretty bad right now. Let's let's give that one the friendly reset. What else have we got here?
Now we took some damage there. That's okay. That's to be expected. Right up the bungus. Perfect, Cuphead, you tool. Peter O'Toole. Recently saw a Peter O'Toole movie. Sunday, Monday, Saturday, happy days. It wasn't a very happy day. When I watched the Harold Ramis directed Robin Williams, Peter O'Toole starring thing. I don't even remember what it was called. It was that lame shitty resort movie starring Robin Williams seems to be miscast oh it's right the Hydra oh shit I think we need a better weapon for this first form there's something just not working here I don't have that many weapons, sadly. I suppose I could go offline, collect a couple more coins, get us a few more weapons. And quite frankly, folks, I think that this is about it. We're uh, tailing off here. We're going to do one more shot at that crazy robot boss, because I've only attempted it the few times you've seen tonight, and I don't really th think that's adequate. All we've got on stage three is that B got the run and gun stage that's optional that doesn't matter we got this robot the junkyard jive turkey Oh, it's a bomb. I hate that bomb thing. Someone set up us the bomb. we got we have not gotten very far on this boss let's see if we can get to a different form at least get to a nice point to hang it up for the night because you can only cuphead for so long people Give it a retry, the friendly retry. Yeah, we're we're starting to fade at this point here, but we've done a lot of good work. I just wish there was some sort of counter that said how I think we're only down to three bosses left and we can head down to that. Satan's asshole.
Oh, whoopsie daisy, should have seen that coming. All right, that went to shit quickly. So we're gonna call it, folks. On that note, thank you, everybody, tuning in here, season three, our last season. We're racing to 100. I think we've got three or four more games, maybe five, I don't know. I have to consult the spreadsheet, the almighty spreadsheet. We'll figure out how many games we have left to beat and we'll beat them. And after that, well, until then, we'll be back for our third round of Cuphead on Thursday. Will the cup be half empty, or will it be entirely filled with piss? We'll find out then. But until then, we'll see you soon. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. Be well, and we'll see you Thursday at 6 for Part 3. Until then... Ta-da.